this course i recommend for people who want to get started in devops so it's like you know 600 us dollars which is a really pricey course for students we'll be giving this away for free we'll be giving this away for free all you have to do is share your kubecon experience in a blog so i recommend you to do write and you can add in the tag this is how we will find it here add a tag blogs with cc all right this is an important video because i'm answering a lot of questions in this one so i often times see social media posts like this that say that hey i got a tech job because i started blogging right so i saw some posts like this like hey i started blogging on hashnode and i got this offer now students reached out to me kunal is it really possible how do we get started with blogging and is it like a really good thing to do in order to you know up your skills and up your profiles in order to get a tech job i would say 100% that is accurate and in this video i'm going to show you how to do it so this video is about how you can use hashnode uh, you know as a as a blogging platform to get tech jobs and uh, basically learn in public and enhance your public profile let's get started so let's talk a little bit more about why blogging can really help you in getting jobs so it's all about learning in public it's about building credibility so learning in public is not about having the number of followers it's about building credibility and blogging is one of the great ways to do it so for example hey i'm applying for a web developer role or something like that and you have lots of nice blogs written you have put your knowledge out there you know what you're talking about you spoke at a conference you wrote a you know you wrote a blog on that and you're just having discussions in public and people know you know that this person knows what they are talking about you're contributing to open source projects you're documenting a journey over there so blogging you know ties all of these thing together so it's a great way to you know get involved in the community especially if you talk roles like you know that are let's say you're maintaining the documentation you're a technical writer 100% blogging is definitely going to take your career to next level so obviously as developers as well you know devrels for examples uh, community managers technical writers it's all about building that credibility and in that case hashnode as a platform can yeah definitely help help you if you want to get started as a as a blogger as a developer you want to document your journey so let's see how we can use the platform and how basically you can get started so if you are at your at this stage in life like hey i've never written a blog i don't have a blog i don't have my own uh, you know platform or whatever this video is for you so let's see step by step how you can get started so this is what the hashnode uh, platform looks like and uh, i'm ask, answering one more question that i get you know how does it compare with medium i personally don't like medium that much i used to use medium quite a lot like one year ago i had like uh, few thousand followers but i deleted my account uh, when i found out about hashnode there is also something personal with me i don't like to have like multiple platforms for the same thing and i truly believe hashnode was like the better one when compared to medium in what ways so the reason is it's i believe medium is not optimized for tech blogging right so if you want to add code snippets and stuff you have to upload a gist for example and uh, it's not just for developers or like uh, you know engineers ai folks or, or or you know basically most things in tech because on medium you'll also find like food bloggers and things like that which is fine for that but i i don't want to be uh, i want it to be specifically for the domains that i'm working on and i want to and i'm discovering fields like this i only want to see tech content and that is why i moved away from medium as well if you want to learn more about it you can check out this hashnode.com or you can go to vs/medium you can see there are no you know no no paywalls when it comes to hashnode so yeah completely free if you want to start your own newsletter or your blogs you know for example and i'll show you how to do that right now both of my communities newsletter community classroom and uh, cube world are on hashnode it's completely free i don't pay anything and you have a custom domain it's also 100% free you know the markdown editor thing that i just mentioned syntax highlighting is there which is not in de- uh, not in uh, you know medium there's a community of developers because the thing is most people also don't like to blog but they want to consume the content for example you want to learn something you want to get started you know watch some tutorial like read some tutorials or just uh, discover people and all these are things you can do that there's a feed section over here in hashnode as you can see these are all the highlighted you know, developers these are all the trending and you know your personalized feed so you can follow people and you will get personalized feed you can change your view if you want right and uh, you can check out the writing challenges and stuff by the way we are running community classroom challenges so i'll share about that as well you can win some exciting prizes you can follow topics if you want and and things like that so i believe if you don't like blogging but you want to consume content there is that and apart from that you know you can create static pages and uh, there are series so basically 
what we mean by series is i use series quite a lot so we have case studies this is a dedicated series so it's like a subcategory in my in my blog that's pretty cool my newsletter you know my cube letter as you can see over here there we go so series are also pretty amazing you want to categorize it accordingly you can do that you can share you can share post drafts that is also cool you want to get it reviewed by someone email newsletter which is something i already have you know like if i go to blog.communityclassroom.org you can sign up your you know send your email over here and subscribe to our newsletter right third party widgets so you can see and audio blogs so that's also pretty cool you can read out you know, listen to your article that's a good feature and custom page rules are also available over here so it's amazing you know that how they have focused it around developers and how it's you know free for folks to use and uh, you can also get paid to write you can have sponsors and stuff so i believe what they offer for free it's just unbeatable when compared to other platforms like medium or dev2 okay so let's see how you can get started with it first of all just sign up that's the best way to do it i'll i'll show you my profile so if i just go to my profile right so this is my profile i've added some you know uh, you can add some bios and stuff and uh, like i just show you i can just add a bio and i can add your text tag i'm available for let's say content creation let's say i put kubernetes over here as my text tab and i can say empowering communities via open source and education I've added my urls and things like that over here and uh, that's basically about it you can add whatever you want i can add a profile i can say i can say devrel manager at sibo okay that's my profile i'll update it okay and here you can check out the developer settings if you want you, know, you can generate tokens and all these other things let's take a look at our profile here we go devrel manager at sibo about me my tech stack i'm available for content creation and things like that so what i recommend everyone to do now is you have so you've created your profile you will have your profile like this hashnote.com slash username okay now what i recommend you to do is start your own personal blog do it right now you can do it right now for free don't have to pay anything so what you have to do is click on start a personal blog okay you can for now click on a subdomain Okay, you can create a subdomain like uh, Kunal blog or something like that. Kunal's blog dot hash note dot dev. So once you do that, you know you can access your blog over here. That's it. Just just one click. That was it. Wow! I thought there would be more steps, but great job, hash note. Very easy. So now this is my blog. If you go to Kunal's blog dot hash note dot dev, you will find it. Okay, but I already have two blogs. So you can uh, map your custom domains to it. So if I just go to, you know, manage my blog, I go to dashboards. So you can see I have two blogs already, Community Classroom and CubeWord. So you can start your own blog. Now you can give it a name. You can tell it, you know, you can add some about sections over here and uh, you can turn on the newsletter feature as well. So if you want to have your own blog, that's fine. But I would recommend turning on the newsletter feature so that people can now subscribe to your blog. People can now subscribe to your blog. So if I go to the blog section, okay, you can write a new article, you can do all sorts of things, and uh, folks can also submit their email address, subscribe to your newsletter. So whenever you write a new blog, they will get notified. Amazing work. In just one click, you are able to start your own blog. So I'd recommend you to do that. I would recommend you to do that. Do it right now while you're watching the video. It's very easy. Map a custom domain, customize your experience. You know, you can, you can do all sorts of things, grid layout and uh, uh, you can create series, you can create pages, you can do all sorts of things. Explore on your own and it's pretty amazing. The next thing I want you to do is, KubeCon just happened, right? So we are running hash node challenges. We are giving away some amazing prizes. And uh, this month we're giving away some uh, Linux Foundation courses vouchers. So if I go to LFCS, Linux Foundation Certified System Administrator. This course I recommend for people who want to get started in DevOps. So it's like, you know, 600 US dollars, which is a really pricey course for students. We'll be giving this away for free. We'll be giving this away for free. All you have to do is share your KubeCon experience in a blog. So I recommend you to do write. Click on write. Okay. My 
you you can give any title you want because we will find it we will find your blog uh, just you know random or i can just write i loved kubecon this is just a demo you have to write it extensively don't just write one line just share your experience add links to the talks that you liked if you attended in person or virtually just do it because we gave away thousands of school student scholarships and uh, if you didn't attend kubecon what you can do is you can watch previous kubecon videos on the cncf youtube channel and anything you liked or what you're looking for to the next kubecon or just write about your open source experience that's also fine but please don't miss this opportunity we also give away some uh, some prizes and uh, some swag to people and how are you going to find our blog kunal that's very easy when you click on publish okay you can select the select a blog you want to publish on obviously select on your own and you can add in the tag this is how we will find it here add a tag blogs with cc blogs with cc this is the tag you want to add once you add this tag we will find it okay if you have like uh, a few headlines because this is markdown you can generate tables and stuff and that's basically about it then you click on publish and your blog will be published pretty cool so do that and we'll find your blog and also share about it on socials when you do it so you can tag hashnode and community classroom hashnode you can tag hashnode and community classroom you can see monthly challenges that's it that's how you get started in your with your developer journey i think it's pretty cool and uh, can you get tech jobs via blogging most definitely 100% because it's a great way to showcase your work and build credibility credibility is all, what it's all about you know that you see all the trends in the tech hiring open source you know speaking with people and blogging or creating tutorials for example it's all about credibility and hashnode helps you in doing that so it's basically about it good luck i'm looking forward to seeing your blogs and uh, giving away some exciting prizes we do monthly hashnode challenges so every month we have a prize and uh, thanks a lot for watching if you have any questions check out the links in the description below and if you just started your journey after watching this video take a screenshot and share it on socials encourage other people to do the same and you know just create value write a thread or a blog on like uh, you know why you're using hashnode as a platform what are you excited about when it comes to learning and you know documenting your journey and if you have any questions just send those in the comment section below i'll see you in the next one have a great day